We are joined by the Twin Cities Gay Men's Chorus. They will be performing some of your favorite Beatles songs tonight at the Ted Mann Concert Hall in Minneapolis. More on that in just a bit. Twin Cities Gay Men's Chorus is getting ready to wrap up their season with the All You Need Is Love, the, Beat em, uh, the Beatles Volume 2 concert tonight. More on the event a little later in the show. This weekend, also, the Twin Cities Gay Men's Chorus concludes its 36th season. They are helping to kick off LGBTQ Pride with the concert All You Need Is Love, The Beatles, Volume 2. And joining us this morning is artistic director Ben Riggs. You're so artistic. Ah, uh, thanks, Mike. How thanks, come you're not Jen. singing? Uh, well, sometimes I do sing, but okay. not on this concert. So. Okay, very good. <laughs> well, this has been a real treat already getting a taste of what people can hear, but what are some of the songs that you'll be singing? Sure, well, we're doing so many favorites of the Beatles, like uh, you just heard Blackbird, which is one of my favorites. In just a few minutes, we're going to sing Penny Lane, another of my favorite Beatles songs. Revolution, Back in the USSR. Uh, we're singing Come Together. Uh, All You Need Is Love, of course, because it's the title of the, of the concert. And I think if you have a favorite Beatles song, you're likely to hear it tonight. So we know their contribution to both the British songbook and the American songbook, but why did you guys choose to, to do a whole show on Beatles? I think that the Beatles music, now about 50 years old, mm -hmm. is represents so many relevant topics that we are dealing with right now. They give us so much hope, so much uh, excitement for imagining a world that can be different, and I think mm -hmm. we need that now more than ever. You think about if John Lennon was still mm -hmm. alive, what he might be writing about today. I would love to be able to do yeah. a brand new uh, John Lennon concert today. Yeah. It's such a shame that we lost him so early. And what is your course working towards with, with tonight's concert and tomorrow's? Well, I think it's just knowing that we want to um, reach out to folks who are maybe struggling right now. Mm -hmm. And uh, this idea that we can bring joy and love to everyone, especially in these troubled times, is one of the most important things we can do. We represent all people who have ever been oppressed and ever faced injustice. And I think these songs really speak to that. Well, let's hear uh, your favorite or one of your this favorites. This is one here. of my favorites. All yeah. right, Penny Lane. Thanks, Thank guys. You. Thank you. Penny Lane, there is a barber showing photographs of every head he's had the pleasure to know, and all the people that come and go stop and say hello. On the corner is a banker with a motor car. The little children laugh at him behind his back. And the banker never wears a Mac In the pouring rain Very strange Penny Lane is in my ears And in my eyes Wet beneath the blue suburban skies I sit and meanwhile back Penny Lane, there is a fireman with an hourglass and in his pocket is a portrait of the queen. He likes to keep his fire engine clean. It's a clean machine. Penny Lane is in my ears and in my eyes. Full of fish and finger pies in summer. Meanwhile, back behind the shelf. A pretty nurse is selling poppies from a tray And though she feels as if she's in a play Thank you to the fabulous Twin Cities Gay Men's Chorus for joining us this morning. Sounded wonderful all day. Remember, you can see them live tonight at the Ted Mann Concert Hall. Tickets are still available. Details at WCCO.com. Have a great weekend, everyone. What would you think if I sang out of tune? Would you stand up and walk out on me? Lend me your ears and I'll 
sing you a song and I'll try not to sing out of key. Oh, I get by with a little help from my friends. Mm -hmm, I get high with a little help from my friends. <laughs>